Please welcome the very talented and very handsome Idris Elba. Crazy talented, and I didn't know you were on that song, on that Macklemore song. That's, oh, yeah, yes. That's I, you yeah, in that that's song. Me. I challenge you to a dot. Yeah, that yeah. was me. You and I didn't get to see you. You're in Finding Dory, and I did the press tour in London, and you weren't there. I wasn't there. I got I got a, a tinier role than you, but uh, but there was a hilarious role. So you and Dominic were the seals that were off, 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 that's off. Right. off. That's me. It that's was me. It was so hilarious, and the, the, you two worked together was a big deal because you worked together on The Wire. On The Wire, yeah. so this is the first time we had ever worked together again. It was the first time working with you, but you know when you do voiceovers, you don't get to see. No. I was really bummed about that. I know, I, really, I, wanted, to I wanted to meet to you it. and see you because I'm such a huge fan, and you've got so many things going on this year. Yeah. I don't know how, you must be exhausted. A little bit, yeah. yeah. Because no. really, you uh, Mountain Between Us, uh, and then uh, there's another one coming out, and then uh, Molly's Game, and Thor. And Thor, yeah. And yep. God. Yeah. It's been really busy. I mean, it, you know, it's interesting enough, like these films have been done over the last two years. But they all came out in this year, so yeah. it looks like I've been really, really busy. Well, I have, but you know. Yeah, and and so uh, and you also have to be grateful because when you first came to this country, you did not work for a long time. Yeah, uh, well, yeah. So I moved to New York, uh, young budding actor. You know, mid '90s, sort of late '90s. I had some savings, and then my savings ran out, and I, I didn't couldn't get any work. It was tough times. And you lived in your car. <laughs> and you were a bouncer at a comedy club. Uh, yep, I was a bouncer at uh, the very famous Caroline's, which I think I saw one of your early sets. Really? Yeah. No, I only worked no. there once. So it, maybe you did. It was that one. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and that was funny, right? You were hilarious. Yeah, that was a good no, one. No, it was great. No, yeah. I, I, I met a lot of really talented comedians. And uh, I think I saw you. I think I saw you there one yeah, time. Maybe so. Yeah. I don't remember you. But see how it works out. Yes, see, absolutely. now, like, I, I wish I would have known back then that we both would end up seeing each other here. What yeah. a weird thing. No, I know. So, okay, Molly's game. Let's talk about this. The movie is, first of all, I love poker. Do, do you like poker? No, I, I have no good. Really? I have no clue. Do you know? So, you know nothing about Texas Hold'em? I mean, I had it as on an app on my phone uh -huh. once or twice, yeah. but it, no, I'm no good. So, so I love poker, and I knew about this game that Molly used to have. Really? Real yeah, life? I, I didn't ever go to the games, but because they were $10,000 buy-ins, <laughs> but I heard about these games. Yeah. So I already knew the story, but I didn't know how fascinating the story is. So explain yeah. to people who Molly is and what... Uh, I mean, it is a, a modern-day heroine movie. You know, her, 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 she's a hero. She's mm -hmm. like, you know... Um, Ultimately, she made some choices in her life. She created one of the biggest poker games ever. Uh, very famous people, very, very rich people came to her games, including some very bad people. And at one point in her life, when the games were going so good, the bad people were on the table, she got indicted by, indicted by the FBI. And uh, essentially, she wasn't breaking the law, but uh, so the movie's about that journey. And I think Aaron, Aaron Sorkin, you know, he's one of the greatest uh, screenwriters we've ever done. You know, good, few good men, uh, Steve Jobs. He could have made, this is the first film he's ever directed, okay? And he could have made any movie about any number of people, but I think he chose someone, a, a woman that had a lot of integrity, you know? She, yeah. you know, the, the, the business with poker is, you know, it's decadent, you know, there's a lot of money, there's gambling, there's risky men. And she could have named a bunch of people when she got indicted and made this book, and she didn't. 
And that's what this story's about. And I think Aaron Sorkin made, like, just did an incredible job he did. of making this I film. didn't know he directed it until the end of it. But it's uh, Jessica Chastain and yourself. Mm -hmm. And uh, and I want to have Molly on the show, because I think she's amazing. I yeah. think, I mean, she just, I didn't know her story. I didn't know she was Olympian, that she was a skier. Yeah. Anyway, it's a great movie. And uh, Molly's Game opens in select theaters Christmas Day, nationwide, January 5th. And we're going to take a break. When we come back, we are going to play a game together. Oh. Yep, we'll be back. OK, we're back with a very handsome some Idris Elba, and I imagine you're pretty competitive, right? Oh, yeah, okay. absolutely. I am, too. Mm. So we thought we would play a game. It's one of my favorite games. It's called Danger Word. All right, we need some people to play with. Where are Tanisha Jones and Megan Dester? <laughs> You're gonna be my partner. Oh, okay. Tanisha, you're gonna be Idris's Tanisha, partner. You're so uh, you're gonna come, stand come on, on the in. Red. <laughs> Tanisha, you oh, sit the on the stool over there. You're gonna sit on the red stool okay. over there, Megan, okay? And um, here's how the game works. We are gonna show the audience two words, a winning word and a danger word. Idris and I will have to get our partner to say the winning word without saying the danger word. And you can only use one word clues, just like password. Right. If you say the danger word, I will be forced to push this button. And if you guess the winning word, I'll fire the cannon at the losing team, okay? Okay. Please, Twitch, we will tell the viewers at home our danger word. The winning word is Cheerios. The danger word is cereal. OK. Good. Better. Um, bowl. Noodles? Noodles. OK, no. Uh. Million. Oh, um, Powerball? <laughs> um, cheerful. I know you know what I'm saying. Cheerio? Oh, yeah! <laughs> So sorry. Oh. All right. All right. All right. Okay. Uh, flavors. Tic Tac? OK, I hear, I see where you're going. Frozen. Uh, ooh, yeah. Uh, um, frozen icy? Um, long. <laughs> <laughs> what? Uh, you know, I mean. Popsicle? Oh, my God! Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I'm feeling bad now. I'm, I'm feeling oh. bad for Megan. Oh. All right. No, we're playing one more. Okay. okay. All right. The winning word is champagne. The danger word is wine. I like them both. Megan is not walking away from here with three things in her face. All right. Poor. Congratulations. Marriage? <laughs> yes, no. <laughs> Sparkly. Oh. Champagne? Yes. Ah! <laughs> Good job. Oh. <laughs> uh, 
congratulations. You're winning a 55-inch 4K T-Cell. You're getting one, too. What? Yes, you get a TV, too. That's how you play Major Wood. You're getting one, too. All right, we'll be back.